Hey guys, Tabitha here. So I'm bringing you a video on this Project Life Becky Higgins photo sleeve fuse. There we go. And um, a few of you guys said that you were interested in seeing how this works. I'm going to try to create a shaker card here. So I'm guess I'm just going to open it up and take out all the contents. And we're just basically going to go ahead and get started. It does come with this ruler here, the actual tool. It comes with a stand and this little golden piece here is a cutting tool and this is the fuse tool. Before I even plug it up you guys, I'm actually going to take the fuse tool and it just screws in like that. So make sure that's secure and now I'm going to plug it up. So it's plugged up. A lot of people have been complaining about this stand that it's a little flimsy. Oh yeah, it says place photo sleeve tool stand and plug into outlets photo sleeve fuels will heat to proper temperature in approximately 10 minutes so i'm guessing this is how you prop it like that yeah okay guys it's now 4 21 so i'm gonna do like it says i'm gonna wait till 4 31 and in the meantime i'm going to get my materials ready to create the sleeve and then we're going to come back once it's all heated up and move on to the next step while the fuse tool is heating up, I just want to show you guys some things I'm going to be using. And this is just a tester shaker card, you guys. Like I haven't made a proper one yet. So this is just some sequins that I was thinking about using. This is purple. This is like gold and silver. Now, I know you guys have all seen this. This is actually one of the pill um, holders from the Dollar Tree, but I used it to store some, the, actually the glitter from the Dollar Tree. And I like how it has each color, so you can basically put each color in each container. So I might use a little bit of this. Okay, so I know you guys all remember this book, the Boho Tropical book that we all have found at Michael's. I lucked up and got it when it was only five bucks. This is normally a $20 book. This is the particular page I'm gonna use. I'm actually thinking about using this one or this one here. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna use nah, I think I'm gonna use the pineapple just for starters and then I'm gonna use one of the baseball card holders and I'm just gonna cut it I know I know you shouldn't be cutting these but I have not found the proper the baseball card holders that everyone's been finding I know some people have fought, found them at Walmart I know some people have found them on Amazon I have yet to find it so if you guys have a link on Amazon or eBay where I can buy those that would be great but I'm just gonna go ahead and cut one of these out that's what that is going to look like after I cut it now if as you guys notice I am going to have to trim the card just a bit just a little bit but I'm gonna go ahead and cut this out as well and this is what I use for some quick cuts I think I got this actually my hubby uh, bought this but it ended up being too small for the for what he needed to use it for so I, did, I basically have been using it and it's perfect size for what I needed to use for which is my crafting so I'm gonna go ahead and use this and of course you guys know I got I think I actually my hubby actually used a 50% off coupon for this so I think this was probably uh, like $11 something like this is not So that is what that looks like cut out and I'm going to try to fit it in here and see how much more. Yeah, so I, I got to cut it just a tad bit more around the edges because it's not going to fit in the shaker. to trim it but as you guys can see it now fits into the shaker but like I said I need to be able to close it so I'm gonna have to trim just a little bit off of the top I don't want to have to do that but why I need the proper sleeves you guys because yeah I'm gonna trim a little bit more off the bottom and the top here you guys so I did have to trim it quite a bit like I said I need the proper I need the proper photo sleeves or the proper baseball card sleeves so I won't have to trim as much off these little cards but now that we have this complete I am going to add a little bit on the inside so I think I'm going to add a little bit of that gold sequence and if you guys remember I hauled this I got this from um I got this from Walmart oops I got this from Walmart for like 
like a 97 cents or something like that. So I'm going to add a little bit of that. Uh, you know what? I think that that's good. I don't want to take away from, I don't want to hide the picture too much. And I'm also going to add a little bit of this purple. I think that that would be cute. Now we're just going to pour. Oh, yeah, I think that that's good. I don't want to pour too much. I love glitter, so I'm definitely going to add, is this more? It's a, a little bit more of a yellow glitter, I think, more than... So I'm going to add some of this, like, I don't know if this is gold or yellow, but I like it. So I'm going to add a little bit in there. Okay, so we got that. Since it has a little bit of green in there, I think I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit of green. Ah. Okay. So now that I basically have what I want in the shaker car, let's move over to the fuse tool, the fun part. So I know a few people have been complaining or not, well, yeah, basically um, they don't like this stand. They felt like it was a little flimsy. It's not too bad as long as you, it seems like if you put it in between here that it would stay better. You kind of get it like that. So I did number one, insert fuse tool into photo sleeve fuse. Place uh, photo sleeve tool on tool stand and plug in. We let that warm up. I, I can actually smell it. I can smell it. <laughs> so number three, align the ruler stencil to fuse in straight line and desired length. And then it says to apply steady pressure and roll the tip along the ruler stencil groove at a swift pace. I'm going to make sure this is flat. Hope you guys that. Okay, so I'm going to try to put it right at the edge here, right where I want it. Moment of truth, you guys. Moment of truth. Works. Oh. Here go the sirens. Never fails every video. This ruler here, I know a lot of people said they don't really use it, but I think that it's pretty good because you have a specific point where you're going to use it at and then you won't have to worry about, you know, accidentally fusing something else or, you you know, whatever. It, it kind of just makes it more, uh, better to not make any mistakes, I guess I would say. Moment of truth, you guys. Let's see. Nothing's coming out. I made my first shaker card. Yay. So check that out, you guys. Shaker, 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 shaker. Okay, guys, so I wanted to do a close-up so you guys can see how it turned out there. So I just had a little bit. You don't have, you have to plot up some pressure to it, but you don't have to be super hard with it. So that's my first time using this, and I'm in love. I'm going to be just fusing everything now. And if you guys kind of notice the tips here or along here that, you know, this that I fuse, it kind of looks like the rest of this. So I have created my first official shaker card using my fuse tool. Yay. So if you guys see all this fallout here, what happened was the edge where I had originally cut the baseball card holder out, there was a hole there. So all I did is just fuse that. And it is all to the good. So, yeah, I love it. It's super, super cute. In shaker cards, you can pretty much put anything you want in it. I'm really liking it. It's super cute. So, this is something cool that you can add in pocket letters and things like that. Thoughts on this Project Life Fuse Tool? I absolutely love it. I would definitely recommend, if you guys do not have a fuse tool, I would definitely recommend getting one. Again, you guys know Michaels always have coupons, 40% off, 50% off. I had a 40% off. You guys, this is $30, $29.99 at Michaels. I had the 40% off coupon, which brought it down to $17.99. That was a pretty good deal to me. Anything is better than regular price to me. So if you guys look out and get a 50% off coupon, then you only have to pay $15 or $14.99. Thank you guys so much. I hope that uh, the ones that were interested, I hope that you guys uh, realize or, you know, saw how simple it was to do. 
and for someone like myself you know i was like i was always struggling with creating these but now i have a tool so thank you guys so much for watching i really appreciate you guys and i will check you guys out in the next video bye I want it, want it. I